cross for us. Yeah. All that he did and all that he went through was just because he loved each and every one of us. And you know, we're serving a risen Savior this morning. You know, hell and death and the grave, you know, the devil himself tried everything they could do to keep him in that ground. But he was coming out. You know, he was coming out. And you think about, you know, I wish I could have been there. See that, to feel that power. You know, what? they took that body of Jesus and took him off that cross. He was so beat and so bruised and so battered, right. so mistreated. You know, and he laid there for, you know, from Friday evening, all day Saturday, but when Sunday morning came, you know, he still laid there, still battered and bruised. But the power of the Holy Ghost, the power of that resurrection, walked in that tomb and instantly, yeah. all those wounds are gone, are healed. You know, we're that way when we're lost. You know, I was lost. This old heart was dark and fear was in it. You know, I was scared to death to lay my head on the pillow at night. Jesus, don't come. I know you've all prayed it. Jesus, don't come tonight because I'm going to be left here. But all that fear, you know, as soon as I was helped, right over there in one of those classrooms one Sunday morning, Stephen was teaching. The Spirit of God dealt with my heart like you've never dealt with it before. And you know, as soon as I put my knee to that ground and I said, yes, Jesus, instantly, all that was gone. I mean, yes, clearly that fountain of life sprung up in my soul, and it's still springing up this morning. Praise it's just God. as real, and it's just as sweet as it's ever been. And, you know, the best thing about it, it's not over. The best is yet to come. Yeah. We're talking about a resurrection. When Jesus steps out on that eastern cloud and calls his church home, and the angel blows that trumpet so it's going to sound so loud that it's going to open up every door. Yeah. Yeah. Saint that's come on. Before. I got family members in this ground. I got a little boy. Oh, yeah. See, they're at off Normandy Boulevard right now. When that trumpet sounds, he's coming out of that ground. Oh, that grave ain't no hard in there. That song they used to sing, I know that Sister Sissy and used to sing, there ain't no grave gonna hold this body down. But Sister June, we just laid her to rest. She's coming out of that ground. Yeah. You know, we're gonna meet him. And then those of us that are alive and remain, if we're ready to go, if we're looking for him, we're gonna be called up to meet him with him. And he said, we won't know what we'll be, but there's one thing for sure, we're gonna be like him. Hey. We're gonna be like him. I'm striving my very best to become like him on this earth, and I'll never reach it. But one day I'm going to be just like you. Oh, yeah. We're going to be in heaven. And if you're not ready this morning and you don't have that peace that God in this morning, there's no better place to be than here. No better day, Easter morning. You can give your heart and your life right here before you. Before you leave today, you can be heaven bound with your name written hey. in that book of the Lamb of God. Just pray for us and worship with us at this morning. Oh, yeah. Yeah. When man Oh, my word. 